Welcome. The Google team has some exciting news to share today. You can now include captions with a Google Meet video recording. When including captions in your meeting recordings can help make them more useful and accessible for meeting participants. Let's go ahead and dive deeper about this amazing update. As you can see, I'm currently in a Google Meet. And we're going to talk about closed captions. First of all, you can always turn on closed captions during the meeting. You can click on the rectangle box with the CC letters inside and turn on closed captions. And you will see the closed captions at the bottom. Now, many of us think of closed captions was developed to aid the deaf and the hard of hearing, but it's very useful for a variety of situations. For example, closed captions can be read with audio, can't be heard, either maybe you have a noisy environment such as an airport, or you just want to must want to keep quiet when you're in a hospital. So it can be used for multiple facets. So with that, I just want to point out some of the benefits of closed captions and not just what we normally thought of when closed captions was originally developed. So with that, let's go ahead and talk about this amazing update. I'm going to go ahead and turn off closed captions before I show you how it works with the recording. So to turn it off, you just click on turn off closed captions. Now, if I want to go ahead and record this Google meeting, I can always do that, which is the same process we're used to. So I'm going to click on the activity button and choose recording. Now with that, you have a new option, which is to select captions. You do have several different languages if you choose to, but I'm going to go ahead and select English and then I'm going to select start recording. So I'm going to go ahead and select start recording. And now, as always, it's always good to ask everybody that you're recording and make sure it's okay. I'm going to go ahead and hit start. So you can see there's a new um, icon at the top left hand corner indicating that this current Google Meet is being recorded. So notice though, I do not have closed captions on. You do not need to have closed captions on for it to generate the closed caption on the recording. So that's very important to be aware of. So obviously I'm talking in this meeting and if someone else talks in this meeting, they would also pull up that information as well. So we'll pretend now that the meeting is over and we're gonna go ahead and stop recording. And I'm going to go ahead and end the call. Now I am in my email and you can see that I have the email that we're used to seeing when recordings have been uploaded and ready for you to view. I'm gonna go ahead and click on the video recording See there, and you can, um, I have the top left caption indicate are appearing at the bottom. Now you can always turn on and off your closed captions by clicking on the closed caption icon and turn it off or turn it back on if you choose to. The other thing I want to point out is you always can click on the settings and you can adjust your subtitles if you choose to. You can turn it off as mentioned, and you have options to adjust the view of it as well. I'm going to go ahead and click options. And you can always adjust these format options to fit your needs. The other thing I want to mention is do be a little patient. It does take a little bit longer for the captions to appear. So if you click on the video right away after it is appearing in your inbox and it's no longer rendering, um, I didn't make note that sometimes the captions take a little bit longer to appear on the video. So you can always go back to it a little bit later and you'll see the closed captions will appear. With that, I want to remind you to check out the resources posted below to learn more about this update, and thank you.